The Dibner Library uh, houses many smaller collections, primarily the core collection that came from Dibner, Bern Dibner, an electrical engineer who was born on the turn of the 19th and 20th century and amassed uh, probably the world's largest history of science and technology collection at the time when uh, it was on its peak. This was around the 1950s. Bern Dibner said that science is a social power. He thought that it actually promises the distributed and great power and well-being that people can get through the development of science. This is what these collections, including the World's Fair collection, represent. And the World's Fairs really opened up this distribution to the widest possible extent.